I think I'm nesting. So before I let you all know that I was pregnant, I actually went through a huge closet clean and cleaned out my entire closet and got rid of a bunch of clothes. And I have the urge to do it again. But this time, we're gonna do it in the kitchen. It's a little messy around, sorry. We're gonna do it to the pantry. I'm gonna show you guys how messy this pantry is. It's gone bad. So here's the pantry. Uh, we did have it organized at one point, um, like with these little racks and stuff, but it just got so messy. Like things weren't put back where they belong and you know, what happens? So we're gonna tackle this. Let's get a nice before shot. I'm also going to tackle our spice rack. Um, we have a little Lazy Susan right here for her spices. Um, but again, this is just out of control. Um, it started off with just spices and then, um, you know, got messy. It's also very dark in here. So Red actually, he bought some lights that we can put underneath. I also bought myself some storage for the pantry just because I want to be able to find everything. I want everything to be labeled. I want to be one of those girls. I want to have that household that is like so organized. I want to put the flower in another jar, in another bin, in a clear bin. I bought like a bunch of uh, organization stuff. So yeah, we're just gonna try to reorganize this and make it easier for whenever the baby comes for me to find stuff and for us to be more efficient and quicker and to, you know, not buy multiple items because we can't find it in the pantry. That's what I'm doing today. And it's a nice rainy day here in LA. Actually, today is the day we are picking up our puppy. <laughs> I feel like a lot of things are happening right now. So yeah, we're picking up our puppy later today, like around four or five. It's currently 12 o'clock. So I'll have some time to clean out this kitchen and make this pantry look nice. Okay, this is gonna be difficult for me to do, but I think the best route for me to go is just completely clear out this pantry. I'm gonna start row by row and just kind of organize things on this counter. So let's just do a little time lapse and we're gonna clean it all out. Pantry's all emptied out. This is gonna take a lot longer than I thought, but I have everything sectioned out. So I have baking stuff in one section. This is kind of like edible, like pancake mix and, you know, like pasta. And then we have sauces over here. I really don't know what to categorize this stuff as, but we'll figure it out. We have drinks and like refillable stuff here. Some spices here. These are not all of our spices. And then our medicine cabinet. Oh my gosh, that's so much stuff. So now that I have it all emptied out, I'm gonna wipe down the cabinets and throw away whatever's expired because I definitely know there are some expired foods and medicines that are in there. And then we will get to organizing everything, which is really why we're all here, right? Right now I'm organizing some things already. Went through everything, threw out all of the expired stuff. We cleared out our little Lazy Susan area. Hubby Red came up to help. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We have two full trash bags. Oh God, we had a spill. Two full trash bags of expired stuff. And then this was everything that was down there. We took out the little things, cleaned them. You're gonna install the light right now. Yeah, this is a motion sensor light. So put it here. Nice. Sensors right you here. You can actually see in there. 
think I'm going to go through the baking stuff right now and start putting some stuff in our little containers. So I need to find the label maker and figure out how to use that because I haven't used it in ages. Okay, so the time is now 3.40. I've been at it for a while, but we made some good progress. I pretty much put all the baking stuff in containers and labeled them. So we're gonna get all of this into the pantry over there. We have stuff already kind of just categorized and grouped together. Uh, we have our spices that we have custom little labels and vials for that we'll probably do later. I think we're gonna tackle the pantry for now. We're gonna put everything back in and organize it. This is what we're thinking. All right, so the top I'm thinking of putting all the baking stuff. Here, I think we're putting I don't know where we're putting. What are we putting? Uh, maybe some of this stuff. I don't know. Snacks? Okay, so snacks. we had snacks, some snacks over here, but we decided to move them over and move our vitamins over show here. The vitamins. Mm. I'll show you the vitamins, but the rest of it's very messy. But here is the vitamins. This is the one organized shelf. So we used to have our snacks in here. These are the vitamins, and we're gonna do this another day, the rest of it. Mm -hmm. So we wanted to put like snacks in maybe this one or this one, I'm not sure. We wanted to keep it like toddler height so that when baby's old enough, can help help us put stuff away. All the snacks. We can put them to work by helping us put groceries away. <laughs> so then the bottom area is gonna be like, I'm gonna get two baskets and they'll be like the refillable stuff, but I just wanna cover them. I don't want them visible. So yeah, let's put stuff away. Let's do it. It's time to take a little break. We gotta go run to the store. We still have a lot to go. This is a big project. Gotta put this away, gotta put this away, gotta label all these. This can't be a one person type of job. No, it has to be a whole household thing because how else are you gonna keep it clean? All right, so we went to the store and we finished putting everything away. I think I might need like one more container, but I wanted to show you guys the final pantry. Okay, so here is what the pantry looks like now. So much more organized. I know what items I have. We got everything labeled. This is all the baking stuff. And then this is like um, syrups and like honey. And then down here we have like breakfast stuff. And then in this row we have the snacks. So we got some cookies. Uh, we have some healthy snacks in here, some cereal. And then if we pull out this guy, inside of this I have just some refill drinks our aprons, and then all of our spices and sauces, hot sauces. And then down here, oh, we lost some topos, they fell over. Some more refilled drinks and apple cider vinegar, cranberry juice. What a difference though. I swear having a clean and organized pantry has made my life so much easier. And I've been baking a lot more, we've been cooking a lot more, we know exactly what's in our pantry. I wanna show you guys the spice rack really fast, but here is the spice rack. I installed some automatic um, lights up here, but here are our spices that we relabeled. Kept some of the original packaging because we didn't have enough to, to transfer all of them. It looks so much nicer. Who would have thought having an organized life? I don't know if you guys could hear Maya. She's talking right now. 
What are you saying? You want to say hi to everyone? So yeah, this is just one of many projects that I plan to organize and clean out before the baby comes. Um, I think I'm just going to create a series called nesting because there's so many different projects that I have to do and that I've just been putting off and I want to do them before baby comes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this and it was at least somewhat satisfying to you or inspiring to organize your pantry. It is a daunting task. Feel free to leave your organization tips and tricks in the comments below. Let me know if you have any places in your house that you need to organize and maybe I can organize my place in my house because there's, there's a lot. I hope you guys have a great day. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you all later. Bye-bye.